Dan Olbersky, and I'm owner of Trinity Commercial Group. All throughout growing up, I uh, grew up very close to our grandparents. Um, my grandpa was in real estate. He had been in a countless number of other ventures and got us involved in um, kind of gambling young. We, we got the little flip cups where you catch the ball in it, and he'd give us a buck and then do double or nothing. And we'd play liar's poker, and we'd try anything and everything under the sun to take grandpa's money, and he normally got it back, normally got it back. But we also got engaged in just thinking outside the box and, and taking risk and having fun. And so when I was eight years old, I, I started a lawn mowing company. By company, I mean we started mowing one lawn. Started making some money, started saving some money. And as a pastor's kid, I wanted to be able to go to college and didn't know whether or not mom and dad were going to be able to help make it happen. So we started saving some money. Uh, and we were up at my grandpa's cottage. I was sitting down on his lap in the rocker right in front of the fire. And he was on, he had gotten a phone call and he was kind of processing this deal out loud with, with my grandma. Um, and he said that there was a hunting lodge that was a, uh, or hunting license that was available and that he could buy it and he thought there was a lot of value in it. He thought he could probably sell it and make some money on it, which really intrigued me because I just wanted to make money at the time. And so I, uh, I worked with him, asked him if I could you know, put some money into the deal. And as I remember it, we put in about, I put in about $300 and we flipped out of that for somewhere in the range of $24,000, what we had bought for $17,000. And I made 150 bucks or something on it. So that was my first investment deal with my grandpa, with family. And uh, I've been addicted ever since to real estate, to deals. And that was just where we started. So it was a lot of fun. This, obviously it says start. There's, there's five letters, so it works good because I have five kids. Um, start is, was my grandpa, Les Hudson, who got me involved in the business, his favorite word. And he just got sick of procrastinating. And, um, it, and that's, like, that's what we like to do, is we like to find opportunities and get going on it. And so that's, that's my word. Uh, my kids that are, are here are Alex is my oldest. He's 10 years old. Uh, we just were blessed to be able to adopt him uh, July 3rd into our family. So he's brand new. Uh, Sydney is eight and a half. She'll be nine in February. She's a cheerleader. We just started soccer and sports and it's hilarious to watch little kids do sports. She was in the back and she loves being with people. She's got the cutest outfit on. I mean, she's got the pink socks and just everything's decked out. And she's playing defense because her coach realizes she's not too into this. And she's watching her best friend on the other field play and cheer. So that's my cheerleader in Sydney. Maddie is my adventurer. She's six years old and she's just, she's enormously athletic and talented. So she's climbing the A just because it's probably the hardest thing I could draw on here. And Maddie's just a blast. Ellie is my little peanut. We call her Ellie Beans. She's five years old. She is precious. She's blonde little cartoon, cute as can be, and just fun. And she's, she's wonderful. Hudson is my two-year-old. He'll be three October 29th. And he has this head, like it's my head on a two-year-old, and, and just runs into things with it. He's playing with a truck here, but he could be playing with anything. He's the most gentle-hearted, sweet child in the world. Uh, and just a, like a big tank that that walks around and talks really cute. So that's my picture at start and my five kids, my beautiful wife. I didn't want to depict her with crayons, uh, but Kristen is her name. <laughs>